to my YouTube channel if you don't know who I am. My name is RMA and I'm in a plus size fashion. So today's video we are doing an old navy try on haul. I have a lot of items. I think I have maybe like 14 items. It's going to be a pretty big haul. I might have more. I'm not sure. I just did not realize how cute old navy's clothes are and actually how affordable they are as well. So I was like you know what? I gotta do a clothing haul from them. So everything I will be sharing with you guys today will be linked in the description box below as well as my stats. So you can check my measurements and I'll link to my Poshmark closet so you can shop my size. As always, if you have any questions, comments, or video suggestions, please let me know because I do love hearing back from you guys. So without further ado, let's get straight into this video. The first I'm going to show you guys today is this top. It's called the Fitted Linen Blend Tie Shoulder Crop Cami Top. And I got a size double XL and the bottoms are called the Curvy High Waisted OG Straight Button Fly Jean Shorts. Three inch seam. Got them in a size 20. Let's go ahead and start with this top. Unfortunately, this top is way too big on me. I got a double XL because what I usually am, especially in like Target brands but as you can tell there is a lot of room. It is smocked in the back but if I had sized down to an XL it probably would have fit much better especially because it does have that smocking but without stretching it I literally have so much room. I also have a smaller chest that could be wide but unfortunately it just doesn't fit for me. They are tie straps and they are adjustable. I absolutely love this pattern. The material itself is super thick and lined. It is not stretchy but that smocked back does give you a little bit more stretch. Unfortunately I won't be keeping this. I am tempted to buy this in a size down because I really like the print. I think it's so cute but it just doesn't fit me the way I would hope which makes me a little worried because I have not tried on any of these clothes and I think I got all the tops in a size double XL so hopefully they fit good. We're about to find out but overall cute idea just need a size down. Now these bottoms are super great. They do roll up a lot. I don't know if that's because I have like bigger thighs but when I do like walk around I notice that this rolls up and then it just looks really weird because my thighs are eating the shorts. It is a roll up bottom so you could roll these down personally I like the look of them they're fine they are not really like chafe friendly but again just get like a chafing stick and it'll be fine they are also super duper stretchy they don't like look stretchy when I do that but they do have some stretch in them and the color is really pretty as well they are buttoned into zipper closure and they do have back and front pockets I don't really have anything else to say they fit pretty well in the thighs other than like rolling up and the back is good as well it has a tiny back gap but nothing that bothers me too much but I'll go ahead and show you what the back looks like so you can see an idea of how it looks in the back. Cutting in real quick to say that there's a huge camel tone so I take that back. I do have some complaints. I will not be keeping these. Maybe a size up would benefit me but I would definitely have a back gap if I were to size up because I do have a smaller waist than my hips. So the next outfit I have a shirt today is this outfit. The top is called the Strappy Rib Knit Crop Tank Top. Got it in the color Golden Straw and it is in a size double XL and I have these high waisted stretch tech pull on surf shorts. 4 inch and see I've got them in the color black jack and in a size 2x. So first things first, I absolutely love this top. I actually think both pieces fit me pretty well. But to start with this top, I love a good rib knit. There is a like liner underneath, like right here. It's kind of like a line, kind of like a built-in shelf bra, which I really appreciate, but I would always wear this top with a bra, so I don't really need it. It is super duper stretchy. It doesn't appear to be super see-through, which I enjoy. And it's this beautiful like yellow color. I have been finding myself really leaning towards yellows and whites especially in the summer time. I just think they're such fun colors and I don't really wear them a lot in my everyday life but I want to start wearing them more. It is super duper comfortable. These straps are adjustable so if you need it higher or lower you can definitely do that and it is a cropped leg. Now these shorts also fit me really really well. They do have a stretchy bottom and the lace have lots of room in them as well which is great because I am bigger thigh. They do have front pockets, they don't have back pockets and they also have a back zipper if you want to put like ear earbuds in them or something like that which I think is great if you're like working out in these. They are a pretty good length on me. I think that if I were to wear these, I would definitely need to have some kind of like chafing stick, but they still look really cute and they're really comfortable as well. And they're great workout shorts if that's what you're interested in. I'm not sure if you can hear that, but it's actually raining outside. So if you can, I'm sorry. But let me go ahead and show you what the back looks like. Okay, so next outfit I'm going to show you guys today is this outfit. The top is called the Fitted Square Neck Ultra Cropped Rib Knit Tank Top. I got in the color Wild Papaya in a size double XL. And the bottoms are called the Higher High Waisted Sky High A-Line Cut Off Workwear Jeans Shorts. 3 inch inseam. Got them in the color Blue Margarita and in a size 22. So first things first, I decided to size up in these shorts. I don't know why I decided to do that. I think I wanted to figure out what my size was because I didn't know if I was a 20 or a 22. I think these fit better than 
the last pair, but they're still like not my perfect fit. They are just a little bit too short on me. I would prefer an inch longer so I don't chafe, but that is personal preference. Other than that, I think they're really good. There is like no stretch in these whatsoever, so that is something that you need to be aware of. But because I did size up, I think they're pretty good. And the other thing that I really like about these shorts is that there is like a belt buckle on the back, so you can tighten it to get rid of the gap, which is so cool. I've never seen it before, but I definitely recommend getting these if you often have back gaps because they will get rid of those because it does have that belt to tighten it in the back. I love that. I think it's so great, especially maybe if you like eat a lot of food one day and you need a little more room, you can look like loosen it in the back and it still looks good. I absolutely love that factor. I think it looks so great. I love the like the distracted raw hem of it. That's how traditional buttons of her closure back and front pockets. I did that backwards, but you know what I mean. But 1010, love these shorts. Not a perfect fit because they're not long enough, but they still work. Now this top is super duper cute. I did get it in a size double XL. If I could, I would size down to an extra large. Man, that rain is so hard. I don't know if you can hear it, but if you do, again, I apologize. I can't control the weather, but this is a pretty nice top. It's not see-through, super duper stretchy. It is ribbed, has a square neckline. You can't adjust the straps on it. And it's like a square, like wide neckline. Oh, uh, it is cropped. I love a good crop top. The color is absolutely stunning. It kind of washes me out a bit, but I think once I get a little bit more tan, it'll look really, really good my skin color but my only qualm is that I wish I had sized down because then it would feel a little bit more tighter I just feel like there's a lot of room especially right here because I do have a smaller chest so I'll go ahead and show you the back but I, overall I like both pieces just wish I had sized down on the top and then got a little bit longer on the bottom this was the item I was most excited for it is called the fit and flare floral tie shoulder mini cami dress I got it in the color pink watercolor floral and I also got it in a size double XL um, I absolutely love this. It is definitely reaching my expectations. I mean, there is a little bit of an issue where like this is a little bit loose up here, but I love this dress so much that I might get my mom to tighten it for me because I just think it's so cute. I also do need to dress these straps because they are a little bit too tall, but that's nothing that a little work won't take. I think it's so stunning though. The color is so pretty. The length is great. You wanna wear bike shorts. It fits really, really well. I think this is like my perfect summer dress if I'm being honest with you. I just love the pattern. I love the colors. I love the fit. This fit is phenomenal. I might have to pick up this dress in other colors or prints because it's so stunning. And it also has a pocket, which we love. The material itself is not stretchy, but it does have a smocked back. I could have possibly sized down to an extra large. My only issue would be that this would be tighter and I like the way it fits on bottom so I think the best avenue for me to go is just to get it tailored up top so it's not so loose and it will be really great I think it's so cute I cannot get enough of this I have no complaints other than the top but that is an easy fix and I cannot wait to wear it this summer because it's so stunning so I'll go ahead and also show what the back looks like but yeah I love this dress and I 10 10 recommend it so this is the next outfit to share with you guys today the top is called the rib knit v neck halter tank top got in the color driver for a size double XL and the bottoms are called the high waisted button fly OG straight rip slit jean shorts. A three inch inseam, I got them in the color Lila and I also got in a size 22. Honestly, I hate these bottoms. They are in a size 22, so they are in like a size up and they're just way too tight. Like if you can tell, I'm like bulging over. Yeah, not a good look. I also do have a back, back gap as well. I think the reason why it's like that is because they're one, a button front denim item, which I absolutely hate that they never fit right. And there also is no stretch. There's like no stretch to it. So definitely not my preference. I absolutely hate them. They are button front. They have, do have front and back pockets. They are pretty high waisted as well. And then a shorter inseam with these little V cutouts. But yeah, not a fan of the shorts. Definitely don't recommend them at all. The top, super duper cute. You can't see its full glory because of this awful pair of bottoms I've put with it, but I think it's very like Barbie centric. There is a shelf bra in it. I would not use it. I would just wear like a bra with it, but if you want that, they do have it. It is a nice halter neckline. You can adjust the halter up here, tie back, and then a v-neck as well. Super duper stretchy, rip knit. I love it. No complaints, not see-through. I think it's adorable. I'm keeping it, but with these bottoms, not good. I don't like it. I'll go ahead and show you the back looks like but this is what 
it looks like. I can tell you right now, both pieces are an absolute no in my book. So the top is called the Fitted One Shoulder Rip Knit Double Tie Strap Top. I got in the color White Lilies in a size double XL. And the bottoms are called the Mid Rise OG Loose Black Wash Rip Cutoff Jean Shorts with a 7 inch inseam. Got them in the color Black Destructed and in a size 20. If I'm being honest, I should have sized down in the top and sized up in the bottoms. The top, it just has a lot of extra room. I know it's meant to be like stretchy but there's just like a lot of extra room. I don't know how to explain it other than that. I don't feel great in it. I feel very slouchy. This tie strap is also really weird. I think it might be better if I like fix it, but I'm not gonna do that for the sake of this video. I just think that overall, I'm not a fan of the top. It is stretchy, it is rib knit. It's a little bit see-through cause it's white. But other than that, it's just a normal top. It is like not really like full length, but not cropped either. It's like a mid cropped on me. Now these shorts are mid rise. My belly button is here for reference. Well, here for reference. Um, they definitely are mid rise. They don't have very much stretch at all, and I feel like a size that would benefit me. However, I have this giant gap back. I don't know if you can see it, but a size up would make it worse. So I think if I were to get a size up, I would also need to always wear with a belt or something or maybe get it tailored because it's just way too big for me. It does have a traditional button and zipper closure, front and back pockets, and it does have belt hoops as well. But again, just not really a good fit for me. I love the length on them and the color, but I definitely need a different size because it just isn't for me. Or maybe like a curvy fit, that might help as well. And then if you're wondering, this is what the bag looks like. Okay, so I'm telling you right now, I don't like either pieces of this either. The top is called the Scallop Trim Ponytail Knit Cami Top. I got it in the color root beer in a size double XL. And the bombs are called the Higher High Waisted Button Fly Sky High A-Line Cutoff Jean Shorts with a three inch inseam and the color fern light wash and I got them in a size 20. So first things first, well I guess we'll talk about this top. This top is just too big again. I, there's just a lot of room right here in the chest area. I definitely need to size down. I love the like detail of it. I love the color. I love the high neck. I love this scallopy hem on the like armpits but again it's just too big for me. It's also a full length top so if I were to wear it I would wear it tucked in but personally not a preference of the fit with me. I think maybe if I got a size down I would be more happy with it. It's not see-through and it's like stretchy but again it's just not my size and then these bottoms are all also, not my size. I should have sized up in the bottoms. They are button front hem, so I'm not going to size up. I hate button front shorts. I'm not sure why I ended up getting these. I feel like I wasn't really reading when I was adding to cart, which is just so sad because I just don't like the fit of these. I don't like any button front. They're too, too tight up here. And then on the bottom, they actually fit really well, but I have this weird like camel toe thing going on. Not a preference. They also say they're like a high rise. My belly button is like above the line, so I don't think it's technically a high rise. I think it's more of a mid-rise or maybe like a shorter high-rise but yeah don't really like other piece they don't fit me that well I do have a giant back gap in these as well which just shows my underwear so it's not a great look but I'll go ahead and show you what the back looks like I guess maybe I'll do a full length back view but yeah definitely not a fan of either piece. I have high high hopes for this one and I am slightly disappointed. So it is called the Power Soft Fit and Flare Shelf Bra Support Cutout Waist Dress. Got in this other Cloisson, Cloisonny. I don't know how to pronounce it but that's what it looks like to me. And I also got it in a size 2X I believe. Um, Unfortunately it just doesn't fit me. I would prefer a skirt two inches longer and also shorts that are two inches longer and also a little more room in the shorts because these are not good chafing shorts and I feel like my legs are pretty tight in this as well. I'm also having an issue up here where I just don't have a big enough chest to fill it out so there is some gapping on the armpits. Not a big fan of that. I love the color though and I love the piping trim on it as well and these cutouts on the sides are so so cute. The material is also super duper comfortable and there are pads but you can remove them if you want. I think the idea is really good it's just not my personal fit and I kind of wish they had made it a little better. I just love this material so much and I love the color so I was really hoping it would turn out good but I just am not a fan of this at all. But I'll go ahead and show you what the side and back looks like because of this cutout and then also this like kind of lower back but overall super cute just 
not really my exact fit. Okay, so this is the next fit I have to show you guys today. The top is called the Crop Small Crossover Halter Cami Top. Got in the color Kala Lilies in a size double XL, and the bottoms are called the High Waisted Poplin Pull On Shorts. Got with a five inch inseam, and I got them in the color Casa Blue in a size two X. So we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll start with this top. It is just like a basic like halter top. I will say you don't tie it. You stick your head through this hole and hope it fits. I would prefer a little bit more room or I feel like it's it's not necessarily choking me but it's just not like comfy if that makes sense um it's, it doesn't appear to be super see-through and it's super duper stretchy it is also kind of more like a full length top but I would obviously wear it tucked in just on my personal preference and it is also like smocked on the inside not on the outside but it's on the inside so there's tons tons of stretch in it I also just really appreciate the color of these bottoms however I think the bottoms a little bit more ill-fitting on me they do have like this weird like V cut down here at the bottom like it's just not flattering whatsoever it is super duper stretchy especially this waistband it is smocked and it was easy to get into because it's just a pull on short but it's just not a good fit on me because it has a weird V shape down here and it's not very flattering on me it is a high waisted pair of bottoms my belly button is here and it goes up to here so I do love that and appreciate that but I don't really like either piece so I'm not going to keep either piece but I'll go ahead and show you what the back looks like for reference this is what the back looks like and then also it has pockets in the front. Okay, so these are the last two items I have to share with you guys today. The top is called the Fitted Rib Knit Cami Top. I got it a size double XL. It was in the color Windswept. And the bottoms are called the Mid-Rise Dolphin Hem Mesh Performance Shorts. Three inch and see I've got them in the color Tanzanite and they and in a size 2X. So we're gonna start this top again. I definitely should have sized down. I have a little bit of like gapping up here and I feel like I could have benefited from it. Benefited from a size down. It is a full length top. I prefer a crop so I would just tuck it in. But if you like full length tops, it's definitely a really good option for you. Just make sure you get it in your correct size. It's not see-through whatsoever. The color is absolutely stunning. These straps are not adjustable but it is super duper stretchy and it's kind of like a rib knit material. I just think this color is so pretty so I might actually purchase this in a size down because I think it is really really cute and I could wear it with a lot of things. Now these bottoms are so weird to me because they are like a basketball fabric they're like very like mesh I would just say I don't know how to explain it this is what I picture like basketball shorts to be especially when I was in middle school or when I played basketball like this was the material of them they are lines so they're not see-through and they say it's mid-rise but my belly button is here and it goes like right above it so I would qualify that as high-rise they are also super duper super duper stretchy and they do have front pockets here I think they are super comfortable I would definitely chafe in these they're definitely more of like a sleep short for me but if you are into active wear this is a good item for you just not something that I personally wear because of all the chafing I would get in my thighs but overall it fits pretty good but not a personal style okay guys that's officially the end of this video if you like this video please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and if you like me a personality definitely subscribe button down below I do a lot of plus size fashion a lot of try and hauls and I'm just here to have an overall good time with you guys as always links to everything are in the description box below as well as my stats so you can check out my measurements and a link to my posture closet so you can shop my size I think that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you appreciate this haul and found items for your summer wardrobe if you have any video or brand suggestions please let me know i do like trying new brands i'm trying to reach my six new brands of the year so without further ado i think that's it and i really appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me recently and i can't wait to see you in the next one bye